Okay everybody and welcome to my review of PDC World Championship Darts. Now I know what you're thinking, a darts game doesn't sound very interesting. Because you don't want to pay 40 quid for the game or 60 dollars if you're in America. Now, this is the um, official World Cup game. I mean I don't follow darts but I know this is the official World Cup dart game so... We're not expecting big fins but we're expecting good stuff. So let's go on the let's go on the character selection, eh? Let's see this. One human, London, yeah, player select. Here we go, I'll pick this Taylor bloke and against part. Let's start the game. Music's actually quite decent. I quite like the music. Okay, the controls, they're very simple. Now let me first start off with the character models. There's not much to model in this game, so you think they could at least work on the character models. They look like PS2 people, and their entrances are all to always the same thing, no matter what, so that's a big downfall. Now let's go to the gameplay. Now, what it is, is you get this little ball, right, this little like target thing, and you point it at something, and then you get a little dart, and you use your right stick up, and you point it downwards, get the power right and um, you let it and you point it upwards when you want to stop your power now let me just try the shots I'm not very good at this but oh well now oh wow let me just turn my volume up so I can show you this really stupid auditory guy And there's also 60. some very stupid, I don't even know where he's from, Ireland, some idiot thinking he's really hard and he like, sounds like a complete idiot, he makes the stupidest comments. Some of them are just been at that bar so long they're charging them rent. I mean, what the fuck is that, man? I'm sorry to swear, but what the hell? Turtle Dross! Tutu just, uh, I'm so posh, oh my god, this is a dark game for fuck's sake. It's so shit, I mean, they could at least get the graphics right, they could at least get the commentary right. I mean, what else do you need to animate? There's not much, it's a disappointing game, you, you suspect they could at least make it more really, you know, make, make it more dark like. I mean, I can imagine this being good on the Wii, but on Xbox and PS3. Or even if it's not coming out on PS3, I have no idea, but on those games consoles, you know, might as well just leave it. Don't buy it. Download the demo, it's a bit of fun if you want to know how to get bored. I mean, let me just completely miss this and see what this idiot says. Call a bin man. Call a bin man. What? The, who says that? Nobody says that. But then again, you do get all the licensed characters, which also is a big, uh, which is a good thing in all sports games because you want to play as the best players there is the tournament modes and all of that exhibition match blah 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 the world cup obviously most of the players are english which i find quite surprising like no one else wants to fucking play this game there's like one canadian that's all that i found so far Wait, I'm so bored, I'm just gonna hit someone. So, anyway, guys, comment, subscribe. It's not a very good game. It's 5 out of 10 at most, being really hey, generous. Atrocious. Just for the bloody darts, because it's the only dart game which is on the next generation. Which I know of, which is really anything, any good or anything. It's just so bad. I mean, you could see the guy on the right. Apparently he's made one of the best players in the world. I don't know if he is, but apparently he's one of the best. You know, you at least think he will, you know, be modelled. I mean, on FIFA 9, the players, all the players are better modelled than him. Even players from teams like Dagenham and Red, like no one's bloody heard of. They're all betterly modelled. I mean, what I am surprised is they do have 3D crowds, which are pretty decent. I mean, they stand up when you get a 180, but... And it's very rare when I get that. And it's not so easy actually this game, which is also a good point because it puts a challenging thing in the game. And there's nothing else really to look forward to in this game. I mean, 
unless you follow dots, you know, you must at least rent it, not buy it. I wouldn't say buy it, I'd say rent it. Because this is going to probably make you mad that you only have it lasting like two seconds. But anyway guys, comment, subscribe and um, I'm going to have more reviews. So I'll see you guys in a bit for my next review.